Hi, it's Will from StormyCastle.com, and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make an origami water bomb. And that's uh, you know, just a square piece of paper that's folded into a shape like this that you can fill, actually fill with water and throw like a bomb. And I'll cut, in a, uh, I'll cut in a quick video here showing me filling it up and throwing it. Open up the hole a little bit if you have to. You know, fill it right up with water. Try to not to let the outside get too wet if you can. Okay, that thing's full. And that's ready to throw. See it? Now if you could, you know, put some tape on it, although getting it wet is not gonna make it easy. And then you're ready to throw it. So all you need is a square piece of paper, like this. And I use an 8 inch piece of paper here, it's kind of a nice size, it makes a pretty good size bomb. So let's get right to folding. And it won't take you long, there's a couple of tricky parts, but I'll walk you through them. Fold this in half, make your creases nice, open it back up. Rotate it, fold it in half again. and open it back up. Now, flip it over. Turn it like this and then fold the diagonals the same way, same, very similar to what you did. Fold and unfold. So fold it diagonally like this. Open it up. Fold it diagonally. And open it up. Now turn it like this so it's square on your square on your in your hands. Now flip it over. Now see this triangle here? There's a triangle here and a triangle here. This is actually all you're going to see when you fold this up. This this fold is a little tricky, but what happens is your pre-folds have already made it pretty much ready to do that. You can push in on this a little bit and see how it wants to do that. Make this triangle here. Same on that side, it wants to make that triangle. So just push those in and flatten out your triangle. Simple as that. Take all four of these flaps and you're going to fold them into the center like this all the way around. Fold it up. Fold it up. Turn it over. Fold them up. There we go. Starting to take shape, huh? Okay. Now, you're going to fold these points into the middle. Just This is two parts. See, there's one here and there's one underneath. You're going to do all four all the way around. Fold this right into the middle here. Try to keep it as close to the middle as you can. Which means this will be horizontal or vertical. See that? Fold it up. Now those are both folded in. Flip it over and do the other side. Fold it into the middle. Like that. Fold it into the middle. There we go. Get in there. Now, there's a flat, there are four flaps here. Two on this side, two on the other side. Fold all four of those down like this. Take this, fold it down so it meets this line. Just like that, forms another nice little triangle. See it? And that's four times. You do that four times. So it's the center line and that line. You do the two on this side. Flip it over. And do the two on that side. We're getting there. We're almost done. Now, the trickiest part of the fold, and you can do this. Open up both these flaps. Fold this into the center. Just like that. Fold that triangle over like that. See it? Do the, flip it over and do the same on the other side. 
Open the flaps. Pull these triangles in again one more time like that. See it? Okay, final four folds. We're almost done. And this is a little bit tricky, but see how you have these flaps here? If you look at those, they're actually composed of two layers. And I'll show you. This is two layers that can open up. See it? So what you want to do is fold this triangle into that flap. And this is a little bit tricky, but if you push on it just right, you can get it to balloon open a little bit. So balloon that open a little bit. Yeah, sharpen that fold. Balloon that open a little bit. Like that. See it? You push on it. And then fold that flap right into that. And it's a little tricky, but you'll get it as far as it'll go. And there we go. Do that four times. Twice on this side and twice on the other. Flip it over and do it twice on the other side. So open that up a little bit. And fold that flap right into that. There we go. Yeah, I'm getting better at it. Flip it over. Same thing on this side. Open that flap up a little bit. Yeah. And tuck that flap right in there. There we go. Open that flap. Tuck it in. Okay, it's all done. So now all you gotta do is the top side is sealed. The bottom side has a hole in it, so you can actually, you know, blow right into that hole and inflate the the inflate the water bottle. And there you go. Ready to go. Now, fill that up with a thin stream of water and um, you're ready to throw it. And you can use different types of paper will last longer in the water, so you might want to experiment with different kinds of paper. And uh, if you don't get the outside too wet, like say you, you're really careful about it, you give it a little piece of tape over this to, to increase the longevity of it. But otherwise, just throw it in a vertical position like this so it doesn't leak. Uh, lots more stuff on my website, www.stormthecastle.com, and lots of origami stuff on my website too. Uh, thanks for watching.